upset? Who's upset? I had a terrific time. You're a great host, Mr. Cashman. You're a nice, soft talker. You pour a small but beautiful glass of scotch. And my compliments to your mother's housekeeping. Where are you going? Out in the street to look for cigarette butts and then home. But don't worry. No one will notice me leaving the building. I'll walk out backwards. What did I say? Why are you so upset? You've got some kind of nerve getting me up here in this furniture museum in that shiny blue suit with your thimble full of scotch sitting there smelling your fingers and telling me I give you the blues. When did I say that? I'm not depressed. I'm not sad. I'm very happy. Listen, I don't have any change. Let me have 30 cents. Maybe I'll get luckier on the bus. Well, please, don't run out. Let me just say something. Say something? You've already talked away half of our allotted time. Now you'll use the other half to wipe my lip prints off the glasses, puff up the pillows, and get the hell out of here. Just lower your voice. Lower, lower my voice. Mr. Brain Broad! Oh, boy. What's the sense Don't of that? Don't tell oh me boy. I depress you, flaming Florentine flounder. I ended up with a goddamn leprechaun. Elaine, Elaine, you're getting yourself unduly upset. Unduly upset? I'm risking a silver bullet between the eyes. I can't even get a lousy cigarette. <coughs> water, I'll get you water. <coughs>